opportunity just to show how dynamic Ricky Ruiz is and what he can do against that big defender. All right, there's the whistle, and we're underway here at HEB Park. The Toros in the all-white kits tonight with the orange numerals. And, of course, Phoenix Rising in black. Almost got a turnover, but here's a chance now for Rising. They move in. Top of the box area. Slip it through, and that's onside. No, it's not. It's not onside. It'll be offside and no goal there. Yeah, able to slip through. Look, he's pushing forward. He's pushing forward. Keep a really close eye. And as this pass comes forward, take a look at 17. That's Greg Hurst. He is most definitely beyond the back line of that defense. Now they'll ease it back to Akwe. Throws in the build up here. Another through ball attempt there by Akwe. Or excuse me, by Ikaza. Here's a cross in the middle. Ruiz is there. And a stop by Lund. Take another look right here. Beautiful cross. Ruiz is there. But Lunt, those cat-like reflexes, keeps that one out of play. Rising uh, with majority of possession here early on, but there you see the Toros, a little bump, and, and now they get it to the foot of a shot at Lund, who makes a barely a save and is able to get that ball to squeak by. A nice shot there by Juan Pablo Torres. And next week is it, the end of the regular season. This is on side. Through ball intended for Torres, moves into the area, creates a shot for himself, and it's off the post. Jay couldn't get the handle. He'll have to chase it down now. There's a lot of pressure being built there, especially with Lunt having to come out to try to challenge a long pass from Tyler Derrick. And now the ball stolen by Torres, gets it to the foot of Fjellberg, shoots, and he scores! Lunt left standing flat-footed, and Fjellberg has the opening goal, it's one nothing Toros. The Toros have been picking and picking and picking all evening. To make a move to try to challenge. Taking a look right here, Fjellberg dribbles this to the side. That's exactly it. I don't think Lunt thought that ball could get through. It looked like his defenders were in a good spot. Specifically, the problem was that Connor Ward just kind of shadowed him in toward the box and was not in a position to receive that well. And here's an opportunity here, a shot and a goal after the referee allows the advantage to continue and it pays off for Phoenix Rising. They get the shot, beat Tyler Derrick and have even the game up here early in the second half. What a very quickly back on the counter. Look at this. Once the counter developed, they were racing, not allowing the Toros even to get in that passing lane. Chance here for the Toros. Spins on. Dribbles into the middle. Now he finds Juan Pablo Torres. Now Fjellberg. Fjellberg moving, trying to create a shot, shoots and scores! Fjellberg has two goals tonight. Hits again at the far post. And the Toros go back in front, two to one. And Jan's been able to dribble himself into a scoring position. Phoenix Rising gives him space to operate, and he puts an absolute laser on net. Look at this. That is spectacular. Lund did a spectacular job of getting out, trying to challenge this, but he just can't get there. You can't place that much better. Chance here now for Phoenix Rising. They get the ball to Moad. Moad out of Spain, now to Jay. Jay trying to go inside is uh, pulled down from behind, and I think this might be a penalty kick. Ooh, that's a huge call right there. Love to see the replay. And Ricketts is going to get the yellow. Another look here as Jay tried to make a move. Ooh, there may be an argument to be made here by the Toros that that happens outside of the box. Take a look. Here's the contact by Ricketts. He pulls his arms back. Jay sells that mm -hmm. by throwing his body forward. That was not Ricketts. It's yep. a huge moment for Phoenix Rising. Derek has not saved a penalty this year. And this will be Quinn to take it. Quinn shot is saved by Derek and kicked free by the Toros. Unbelievable. Huge save by Tyler Derek, and it stays two to one. On the move, going to send this over to the right side. Williams inside. Derek is able to smother that one just before Hurst got there. Otherwise, Hurst. Would have put that in the back of the net. That was placed really well. It looks like Tyler Derrick may have gotten chipped, and indeed he did. They're going to hand a red card to Hurst. And no middle, Williams sends it across. Tyler Derrick gets there with plenty of space to talk about. And then you see Hurst comes in and puts a leg to his head. No need for that. Orals are going to move up to 46 points. Temporarily in fifth place in the playoff ladder. And there's the whistle. It's a final. See Ricketts there and Gaza hugging each other. Toros win it two to one. 
in a